What is going on you guys? Warrior Studios here and today I'm going to be reviewing Skull Slicer which was a 2015 Bionicle Summer set <clears throat> and uh, this guy has got a lot of coolness to him. <clears throat> Four arms, that's good. Special unique mask for the set, that's good. Green, that's cool too. And we're just going to jump right into the review and we will look at the mask here in a bit. So, <clears throat> four arms, which means four weapons on this guy. And they're all just the, uh, well, new at the time. Uh, Mask Stealer Blades, which the idea is you're supposed to have your Toa, and you're just going to clip it like that, rip off his mask, so you can steal the golden mask and get the energy from it. <clears throat> but uh, you got also have this Mask Claw Grabber thing, which you can just grab masks with, which works pretty decently, and I guess, like in the animations, whoops, he sort of rips out of that wall, grabs the mask, and pulls it back to him, so then he can put the golden mask on, in effect, to the green mask, golden green mask. Yeah, so four of these blades, which, in the story, story-wise, the blades are supposed to be fused with hands. Now, in the animations, they weren't fused with hands, because he dropped his blades. So... That's up to you to decide when you're, you know, playing with him or whatever. He just uses the average skull, silver skull spider mask. That's a little bit unfortunate, but it's not ruining the set of that. Let's get a close-up nice right there. Well, not too close-up because my camera's focus is terrible. Uh, there's this printing. Let's get closer. Yeah, there we go. Sorry, but the focus is bad there, you guys. I'm really sorry. I'm using an older camera, and it's not the best. Hopefully, we'll get a new camera here in a bit. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh, he has some trans orange here. And then, of course, you guys saw on the grabber itself, which is down there. Got some books off the side, that's what you saw. Uh, and then he uses the trans orange eye stock, which you can pop the mask off. And real quickly... Let's check out what he looks like with the mask, the other mask, on. That is not a bad look. It looks better than, like, when Skull Warrior puts the mask on. I quite like it. I mean, it still looks like Leewa's mask, and I'm not keeping it on there for the rest of the review. So, I'm just going to put this back on. I think it looks good. And, uh, let's check out, because forearms, which means, and he has the, you know, gear function here in the back. But, what's this? Gears? If you spin it, which I'll show you from the front, let me move that thing, all of his arms move, so that's really nice. Uh, the legs are a little bit not stable because they are freestyle legs, is what I call them. I hope that's the right term, freestyle. I don't know why, I just for some reason I just call it that. But yeah, uh, it might be the right term, I'm not sure, but yeah. So these two move the same way, and then these two move opposite. It does. In interesting how they did that, because on the back, this has just two gears. Ooh, it looks like it's coming out a little bit. That's kind of unfortunate. So, two gears here, and then three gears here. So, when this spins, it spins this one the opposite way, and then spins this one the right way, which then spins that one the opposite way, spinning that one the opposite way, making it go the same way. So, that's pretty interesting. I'm just holding by his head now, and he's doing this little dance. That's really nice. Uh... Also, just off camera here, I have Liwa, as you saw, with his mask that's been infected. And so that's what it looks like on him. Nice look. Cool beans. And the size on him is not too bad, but you could definitely see these guys fighting each other. <coughs> so, I like this set. It's really cool, and... Uh, it's one of my favorite of the Skull Villains, believe it or not. Only thing is the lack of coverage, because they're just, you see, open exposed balls here, here, here. He really doesn't have that much armor. But it still, it looks okay. So I don't mind it that bad. So I'm not going to complain too much about that. And just down here, I have all of the Liwa masks. 2015 Liwa mask, all these variants that I can get my hands on at least. Uh, and so that's what they look like. So yeah, really nice. You got the gold, the trans and gold infected, and then just the normal. So that looks really good. 
And uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below. I'm trying not to bore you guys to death with a long it's a talking review, because I, I tend to talk a lot. So, if you guys like it, leave a like down below. Comment what's your favorite of the 2015 Skull Villains, because I've done all but, let's see, yeah, Skull Grinder versus Akimu. And now that one's coming next, right after this one. So I need to get to that, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So long for now.